Let's uh, I just want to take a look guys, so just kind of bear with me here. Okay, let's take that off. There we go. I want to take a look at the bus and the surroundings and stuff. Yeah, the bus looks good, I like it. I, already I can tell this looks better than Tourist Bus Simulator. So much crisp and more clear. Uh, what do we have in here? Yeah, okay. Not bad, pretty cool. Pretty cool, okay. I'm not gonna bore you guys too much with that. We, uh, we wanna get in the bus here and see the big question. Oh, I kind of like that. They, they changed that from Tourist Bus, that little icon there, so. Okay, here's the bus. It looks good, man. I see the uh, textures on the seats and stuff. I see the textures up there. That looks that looks pretty good. All right, so let's uh, let's board the bus here. Okay, so right away there is no resistance at all on the wheel, so it is just like tourist bus. Basically, with the fanatic, I don't think it's gonna it's gonna work. So that's unfortunate. Maybe you gotta turn the bus on. No, it's no wait. No, I'm gonna have to wait till I get on the road. Okay, so let's see here. Let's shut the door. So the controls are just like, uh, you know, tourist bus. Uh, we can turn these things on probably. There we go. So there's the announcement. We don't need to do that just yet. We can probably do that. So let's see. Drive. Get out of park. Oh, we gotta put the air conditioner on. Set that to around 21, I say. Okay, now let's uh let's see what happens here. Okay, so far. Oh, you know what guys? Hold on. I have to actually do one thing here. Yeah, because I don't like that. So let me just adjust this stuff here. I like to pull this back a little bit. There we go. So, right away, yeah, this looks a lot better than Tourist Bus Simulator. We got red lights, so how cool is that? Oh, man. All right. Well, all right, let's be on our way here. So, I'm not getting resistance. Um, a lot of resistance. But something does feel differently on this. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna say something is with the center spring. It does feel like we do have maybe center spring support, but just not a lot. So I I'm really hoping that they will add that. But I mean, it's working. It's working and it feels a lot better. Did that car just vanish? Oh, so one thing I did... Oop, we just hit the curb. Damn it. Uh, one thing I did, you guys, I turned down the traffic density to uh, to 50%. The only reason why I did that is because when I was watching the British Ace stream, he said that he had some FPS drop in areas, which that is... Uh, yes, I do understand that, and even Fabian from Aerosoft said that that is a uh, thing. But I thought I would try it with the traffic. He had the traffic density turned all the way up to 100, so I thought I would turn it down to about 50 and uh, see how we do with that. But uh, overall, this looks so much better than Tourist Bus. Possibly this one? 
And this is cool because for me, yeah, this is the one I have to be in. Um, you know, I don't know these areas. Oh wow, look at this. Yeah, the wheel feels a lot better. It's not, it's not perfect, but it's working a hell of a lot better than it did with uh, the other games. So. Saying, we'll just go here. I like the way it looks. I mean, you can see the uh, the steering wheel. You can see the the textures on it. Kind of leather, maybe fake leather, maybe vinyl. No, this is probably this is probably leather. I think on these buses, I would say. So yeah, the uh, oh that was that was weird. That was a little bit of a stutter. But uh, yeah. so I'm not gonna beat it up too bad, guys. Now can I do this? Oh, I can. Okay, so yeah, this is just like. Yeah, so let's put the bus in neutral. We'll do that. And uh, let's shut the bus off. Oops, I didn't want to do that. Now I want to do that. Let's get up here. All right, we got all these fine people, so we have to open the luggage doors here. In fact, that can go be open. Is there another one? I think there's on the other side. We can open all these up for now, just because I want to take a look. Oh, yeah. Luggage is in there. Oh, yeah, cool. All right. All right, so let's start checking these people in and see how this works. Um, okay. No, oh, we got log in here. Okay, so where is this guy going? And his name? Y y y is that is it his name? Yeah, sorry if that is. Uh, yep. Okay, he's on. You're good to go, my friend. Oh, we don't have to hold it anymore. That is sweet. Uh, what about you, Berlin? We can't do express checkout yet. Oh wait, what am I doing? Uh, Yannick Pabst? Yes, my friend, you're on the bus. There you go. Let's see here, you look like you're ready to pass out with the heat, so let's see if you're on here. She's going to Berlin... Zaynab? <laughs> oh, dear lord. Uh, wait a minute. Yep. You are on the bus. How about you, sir? Felk, um... Wait, how did I... Okay, I scroll with the up and down pad. Okay, so... Felk, fielder? Yes, sir. You are going with us today. Okay, so the buttons sometimes seem to do a weird thing. How about you, sir? Ah, uh, he's going to Berlin. What is his name? Angelo. Yes, you're number one on the list. All right. What about you? Merrick Decker. Merrick. Yes, you're on, you're on there as well. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to get that close to you. So you are Jaren Mader. Yes, you're on the bus. All right. How about you? Feel loose. You're on the bus. This dude wants to buy a ticket, apparently. Let's see here. So he wants to go to Charleroi? Uh, are we even going there? I don't know. But we'll see. Charleroi. Check. Let's see if he's part of that. Okay, so I'm sorry, but you're not coming with us. <laughs> what about you, Ayla Groove? Uh. Ayla, yes, you're on the bus. Why are you hiding behind the phone, ma'am? Just, you know, don't be shy, Lillian. Lillian, you're on the bus, and I'm gonna guess this guy is also on the bus, Marlo. Yes, he's on the bus as well. I actually had to hit the button twice there. Okay, and you, sir, I apologize, but we are not going where you want to go. All right, so, I forget to close these.
so so far man I think it looks good now I was really thinking about just doing a live stream right off the bat but I just feel like a live stream wouldn't show off the game as well as a video in 4k would so that's why I decided to do a video for soul oh, you know what look guys it goes inside and outside. No more scrolling through 20 different things. So how cool is that? All right, let's, let's close the doors. Oh, and you know what? We have to, we have to start to ride now. That's, that's something new. How do we, okay, start ride. And there we go. Skip the time. All right, now let's hit the uh, the announcements and see what that sounds like. Is this the announcements? Passenger monitors. Oh, on. Oh, it's starting to rain. What? Okay. I... Oh, you know what? Haha. <laughs> I got to start the bus up. Duh. Okay, so now let's try this. Passenger monitors are on. Okay, now let's just be quiet while we can hear the announcement. So it's going to be in German first, guys, and then it will be in uh, in English. And I'm going to have to hit the, the windshield wipers already. So the rain kind of muffles out the announcement sound. I imagine that announcement sound is probably going to get... Whoa, that's weird. Okay, that's weird. Pheasant's just vanishing. So guys, uh, you know... <laughs> this isn't a AAA developer, you know what I mean? So, ooh, there's a little bit of stutter, yeah. There's a little bit of 
stutter. But, uh, you know, I I'm not going to beat him up too bad about the game. Crap, okay. I didn't, I didn't know that. Yeah, I'm not going to beat him up too badly about the game. I'm going to give him a chance. I'm going to give him a chance. They said that they're going to, you know, really work on fixing the game and, and making sure that it's, it gets a lot of updates and stuff. So we're just going to have to give him the benefit of the doubt and, and really see, you know. Um, there's some things that I guess we could just expect with, like, indie games like this, like, pop in and stuff like that. Again, force feedback would be nice. I mean, I don't, I don't know, man. I don't think, I don't think the center spring is working on the fanatic wheel. Definitely drivable on the wheel. I'll say that. I mean, I feel like on Tours Bus Simulator, uh, it would be difficult to, to keep it on the road like this. And I mean, I think the weather effects look really good. I mean, look at the sky. The skybox, I feel, looks really good. I'm really happy with that. Um, again, I'm not happy with the cross menu kind of thing. I'm not happy with, uh, you know, not having buttons mapped to the wheel that I, I can I can map the buttons is what I'm saying to the wheel like you can in say bus simulator but we do not have a game a, a driving game of this scale on console this is this is the uh, the first and only one so far so you know I'm excited about it you don't know no, I mean I do I do feel something with the wheel. I do feel like maybe the littlest bit of resistance. But I, I don't know. Ooh, I'm in the wrong lane. <laughs> okay, something very strange with the audio. Something very strange with the audio with the ring when you're in the uh, in the bus. Oh my god, I'm gonna I'm gonna block traffic here. Can I please have a green light, please? Ring's kinda loud from the outside. I'm gonna have to see him uh see if we can adjust that, but I don't, don't want to do it right now. Oh yeah. Sorry guys, sorry for blocking traffic like that, I apologize. I'm new in town, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, hello, thank you. Okay, so we want to get in this lane. So it should reset the view. Oh, maybe it doesn't. Maybe it will when we start driving. Wow, look at the water on the road. There's a lot of water on the road. Look at uh, use the hydroplane. Well, we weren't careful here. Wow, okay, so yeah, I mean, right out of the gate, this looks so much better than Tourist Bus Simulator, and it's already just handling so much better. Um, I think I probably do have to tweak the traffic density a little bit. There's not a lot of traffic. I have it down to 50, so we should probably bump that up maybe to 75. I don't necessarily want it at 100. But, uh, yeah. 
we'll, uh, we'll play with that. But yeah, we got some beer. <laughs> beer billboards. Okay, so our first stop, well, our second stop actually, is right here. How cool is that? Every time we go to a stop, we get that. We get that. So that's, uh. I don't know. It's a parking brake on. And this time I think we'll just leave the bus running. Let's lower it. And we'll open the doors up. They got off the bus actually, so that's cool. Alright, so we have here for you, ma'am, for you. Uh yes, you are on the bus today. How about you, sir? We have so you and men go. You are on the bus. Sorry, so both you. Zoe Roller. Yes, you're on the bus as well. She wants to play game, I have to hit the F. Voice, so I don't know what that's about. It's not a big deal, but no. Uh, Marco Tiger, Marco, you are on the bus, my friend. Yeah, when it's like this, you have to hit it first. You have to do it. You're on the bus. It's just not that big of a deal. So we can go. Uh, you're on the bus. Hamza, Saiga, you're on the bus. And ah, I thought we were gonna stop you. Okay. Kennedy O'Hanson, sir, you are on the bus as well. Oh, look, look, look at the thing drop outside of it. Yeah, it looks really cool, man. I like that. It looks so really good. So, so far it's performing as expected. Actually, it's performing <laughs> better than I expected. If I'm, uh, if I'm being honest here. Okay, we're closing doors, and we have to start the trip every time here. So we're going to start the ride, and I guess our our time is okay. So we do need to do the announcement every time. Maybe at the next stop we'll we'll play with the traffic density a little bit. This is nice though. This is <laughs> this is actually really enjoyable. That turn here. Obviously, it's it's going to be hard to say you know what's going to happen when you're 10, 20, 30, 50 hours into the game, but uh, yeah, for for just releasing so far, it seems to be pretty good. Red lights are very realistic. Now I am trying this without the mirrors on. <laughs> I figured we shouldn't need them as badly in this game because the roads aren't so crazy. I mean, I do believe there are some roads on this map that get a little crazy. But yeah, so far, I mean, the wheel... I wish the wheel had some resistance to it, I'm not gonna lie. I really wish um, that they had force feedback. I really think force feedback and letting us map certain things to the wheel would be ideal. 
You know what, guys? Let me do one thing here. While I'm thinking of it. Uh, let's go into audio because I, I feel like the rain effects are just kind of... Wait a minute. How do I... And you know that that's fine. Ah. <laughs> How do I? Okay, that's that. All I had to do was hit the X. Oh, how do I... The ambient, I, I I can see that it's got a menu, but I can't. So let's just uh, let's just roll this back to about there. There we go. If you would like to browse the internet free of charge, simply log on to our onboard Wi-Fi network. If your battery runs out, yeah, that sounds a little better. Many of our seats are equipped with power outlets, which are marked accordingly. To book your next journey while you're on the road, simply download the app onto your smartphone <laughs> so you can take advantage of uh, okay. online discounts. For more information, simply visit flixbus.com or get in touch with us on Facebook. Of course, we're always striving to improve our service. Please use the questionnaire we send you by email to give us feedback about your journey. Okay. You can also use it to Whoops. share your suggestions, ideas, and requests. We are always ready to assist. And, and now like the rain has stopped as well. Thank you for listening. We hope you have a relaxing journey and enjoy traveling with Flixbus. So at this light. Sun's coming back out. Nice. Gotta love that. Whoa. Okay, that. <laughs> that didn't go so well for us. That didn't go so well for us. Brokerage Casino. Okay, so that's in Tourist Bus Simulator as well. So, I mean, the graphics look really crisp, really clear to me. Um, that's the one thing that um, on British Aces live stream, the graphics didn't look that crisp and clear, and I do think that's because it was a live stream. Um, I think he's only in 1080p, and, you know, YouTube really compresses um, the live streams horribly. But I'm looking at this, and yeah, I'm, I'm liking what I'm seeing. This looks really good. Does that mean I have to switch lanes, or am I staying in this lane? I have no freaking idea. It's going to take me a long time to get used to, like, these uh, European roads, man. A little different than America. A little different than America. Oh, look at this. Now we're going out into the countryside. It's beautiful. That, you know what? That was the perfect time for the weather to uh to get better in my opinion oops whoa 
Okay. <laughs> Good thing this is where we have to go, man. Holy crap. I should probably pay attention to the sat nav instead of just looking at the scenery. But I mean, this is this is cool, and I like that you can hear the people. I know you guys probably can't hear them because I won't shut up. But let me uh, let me just shut up here and let you guys listen to the ambient sounds. Maybe I should put that other mirror on. <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't move the camera with my wheel. definitely see stuttering here and there um, honestly it's something that I'm pretty used to from playing train sim uh, world 2 not horrible um, takes the eye of the immersion you know a little bit but overall <laughs> I'm actually quite impressed with a, a, a total first look at the game. All right? Obviously, I have no idea what this game is going to be like 50 hours in. But uh, we'll find out. We'll definitely find out. Yeah, see right there. Right there, there's some FPS drop. And it's, it's in a way that it's, uh, it's a little jarring because it is in the way of those those annoying stutters but you know it's the first day the game is out maybe uh maybe they'll they'll fix that who knows again like i said if this was you know a triple a title <laughs> sup <laughs> that's okay that's pretty funny uh again if it was like a triple a title that would bother me a lot more, but, you know, from an indie developer that's apparently a really small team, 
not too bad. I mean, look at this. This this looks really good. And the fact that this is on console, I mean, come on. that <laughs> okay so th there are some strange glitches in the game uh you know i nothing that i, I wasn't expecting though there's a fire truck i believe So, I mean, so far, yeah, like, the steering wheel, it's, it's pretty easy to keep it on the highway. It's pretty easy to keep it centered. I did have that one, uh, one little mistake where I think I took the, uh, the corner a little too fast. If I have to get in that lane, though, to turn, that's, that's going to be tricky if, if our exit's coming up. <laughs> Which, uh, I'm not sure it is. I think this is going to be a, a pretty long long distance on the highway here we're going to arrive at 1332 and it's 11:52, so we still have a lot of time now there are all the seasons in this game there's day night cycles as you can see there's dynamic weather um with the seasons it's pretty cool because like in winter time the, the people are dressed in coats and sweaters and stuff like that uh you know, all the leaves are off the trees, and uh, yeah, yeah, it's definitely got some performance issues. Um, I'm trying to think, man, I, I don't have that a lot Tours Bus Simulator, but then again, this is a lot bigger of a map, so who knows, maybe they can optimize it better, maybe they can get that straightened out. Um, we'll, uh, we'll have to just wait and see. But overall, man, this is really what I've been looking for on a console to have a driving game like this where we have just a massive map that we can explore and we can drive uh oh I really gotta pay attention and that, that sat nav I wish it was just a little bit better with like lane changes and stuff but it's fine the way it is why are these guys going so slow uh it looks like i do have to merge whoa whoa <laughs> okay i guess we all decided that we wanted to do that at the same time so that's not good why are we sitting our brakes on the highway Okay, I guess this is a slow lane, but this is the lane I had to be in. Clearly. Clearly. Hey, there's a taxi. Overtaking this here. I bet I would... I would pass this guy, but what if my exit... Oh, God. Okay, he's going really slow. Sorry about that fire truck. <laughs> Man, you are... Not even doing the speed limit, not even close, my friend. I think it's safe to merge back over. Yeah, I'm gonna have to turn on that side mirror. Just so I can see. Okay, I guess this is the slow lane, which is kind of unfortunate because this is the lane they, they want me to be in. Oh my god, it's raining again.
What is that? What? What in the world? Why is there a harvester crossing the road? Dude, what is going on? This is... Is this farming simulator now? Holy crap. Oh my god. I don't know what's going on. Uh, get me out of here. Holy crap. No. Whoa. Jeez. See that cross menu, man. That's... That's not good. That is not good. That's not good, man. <laughs> uh, why is why is there a harvester in the game? Like I didn't even know. Oh, I am speeding in work zone. That's not good. That's never good. Yeah, why was there a harvester? Is that something that's in the game? I don't know. That was strange. Okay, so this is kind of like uh, the things that you see where there's road work going on. It's very cool that this is in the game. Okay, you need to slow down, my friend. So now I'm kind of interested to know, like, you know, do we see harvesters in the field? What are these guys doing? Wow. Okay, we're going to be coming out of the... Uh, Structure site now. Oh yeah, the wheel is much more responsive in this game than George West Simulator ever thought about being. Oh gosh! Ooh. Why? Why were they stopped like that? Wow, okay, like, wow. I mean, I get that, you know, I have to be a responsible driver and, you know, watch out for things like that, but what the hell? <laughs> you know, I'm just trucking along here, and they just slam on their brakes. What is that about? have 20 kilometers to go so you know I kind of feel like yeah the scale feels good you know it's not it's not too much I really like the weather man the, the weather the way it changes is actually pretty good this is, where, this is our exit right here So, next video, guys, uh, maybe I'll do it on controller. I mean, I don't really know if I have to, because it's going to be just like Tourist Bus Simulator on controller, basically. Um, okay, this taxi's turning, so why don't they turn? It doesn't seem like if you're turning there, the, the red light should stop you. It does? I don't know. I don't know. The rules and laws of the road over here is... Yeah, okay, I guess so. So it does take this bus a little longer to get going. But that makes sense. That makes sense. You wouldn't just, uh... Accelerate crazy. I think we have one more stop after Wolfsburg 2, if I'm not mistaken. So, this is going to be quite a long video, and I apologize, guys, but you know, you got to get a look, good look at the game. And I think uh, I think this route is pretty good. Okay, there's some weird glitches with the shadows. Again, nothing game breaking. It, maybe it pulls you out of the immersion a little bit, but. Nothing, nothing insane. Again, the wheel, the wheel does work. The wheel does work better than it does in Tourist Bus Simulator. But again, I really wish that there was just a little bit of tension on it. 
it's unfortunate. You know, uh, hopefully they'll add force feedback and stuff later on. I'm not going to hold my breath on it, but yeah, it, it would be nice. Alright, so we're in Wolfsburg. town man I'm, I'm digging this what is this is this like a stop i don't know what that means there's our stop right up ahead so that's pretty cool hey we got a cinema over there that's cool man i like that yeah i mean i mean it's just i like that it feels like you know that you're really driving in the real world that's uh that's important in any game like this yeah see every time we go to a new stop like this that happens, so that's a little interesting. Put that in part. Put that neutral. There we go. Open the doors. Put it up here. There's a lot of people here. Let's see the luggage. We got, we got people getting on, we got people wanting to get tickets. Let's go. Let's go to the people. I was summer so I'm the bus ma'am. I was just you are about me. I'm trying. Oh, okay. There we go. Luna. Luna, you are on the bus. Uh, you sure? Alright, let's close the doors. Oh, did I ever? I didn't, you know, I never turned. Ooh. Okay, that's not good. Okay, let's start the ride. And yeah, we have to fast forward time here. Yes, we can absolutely do that. Okay, and we have to do the announcement every time. So let's uh do that. And let's get on our way, shall we? First stop! I'm telling you. Alright. Oh wow, look at the uh the construction work up ahead, the cranes and stuff, that's really cool. That was a uh, bit of a tight corner, a uh, short area right there. Let's uh, let's look outside the bus. Oh, yeah, we're good. We're good. Definitely enjoy the inside view so much better. So much better. Hold down my window. It's my edge. Oops. Haha. <laughs> Gotta pay attention here. Ah, wow, look at how the lights shine out the wet road. I like that. I mean, there's so much we have to see in this game, right? We have to drive at nighttime. We have to see the snow. Maybe, uh, maybe the next route we'll do. Maybe the next video we'll do, we'll actually have it set to uh, the real date and time. You see some winter driving.
so the wheel does come back by itself, so I'm... I'm like a little lost. I'm a little lost there, not gonna lie. So basically, the wheel does work. No force feedback, but again, we, we need that. Wow, it's really 100 kilometers an hour from here? That's... wow, okay. So I think this is our last stop. And uh... <laughs> this is this is a long video, guys. Like I said, I do apologize for that. This is probably going to be a very good game to, to live stream, though. For videos, I'm going to have to really... really figure out what's the ideal time for a video. So I need to keep it like a, a half hour. So I'm going to have to try to figure out what kind of route that'll be, what, what the time frame is in the game compared to that. Whoa! That came up! Uh, okay, I think we're going this way. Yep, we are. So yeah, guys, so far, man, a little bit of stuttering here and there. Nothing that we haven't seen uh, with games like Train Sim World 2, especially on PS4. Um, but other than that, I'm having a lot of fun. This is really enjoyable for me. I would say so much better than Tourist Bus Simulator. Um, even when, especially when Tourist Bus Simulator first came out, it was so much worse than this. So much worse than this. It looks like the skies are lightening up as we go along. I don't know if that's meant to be or if that's a glitch. We're on Schweig. Here's our is our exit. Listen to it gearing down, that sounds good. Oh, listen to the, the windshield wiper squeaking now because the rain's stopping. Oh, that is, that is crazy. So yeah, my, my biggest thing, and it was the same thing with Tourist Westminster as well, is this cross menu. It's just not ideal, man. There. You know, and still, they, they didn't... They didn't map anything. Right? We can't use... We can't use, like, the uh, cruise control or the retard or anything like that, you have to use that cross menu and it just makes it really difficult. So, so far I've seen vehicles kind of vanishing, vehicles popping in. I haven't noticed a lot of the scenery with extreme popping, so that's good. Uh, the roof of the mirrors looks pretty good. There's some popping in the mirrors, but that's, I'm not, I'm not going to complain about that too much. I mean, I'm not staring at that mirror the whole time. You know what I mean? I'm looking ahead of me. And what I'm seeing, I I'm, I'm really liking. So basically, I would say, you know, as long as they keep up on the updates, uh, you know, and they, they work on fixing the, the minor things that I've seen so far, uh, it's going to be a good game. Come on. Turn green. 14 kilometers, so we're going to be there in, in no time at all. These lights are very realistic. <laughs> One thing I wish they would kind of put games is like the, uh, the washer fluid, because I can see the windshield is dirty, my side windows are dirty. The one thing, guys, that I'm a little disappointed in 
is in their Discord, they uh, they kind of said that they're, they're not sure if they're going to bring the football DLC console, which is really disappointing. The console DLC, uh, the console, the football DLC even, is, is really good. Oh, you know what? But now that we can't switch to the, the dash, how am I going to tell if I need fuel? Ooh. What are they honking at, dude? I'm I'm going like 60. Don't honk at me. I'm, I'm speeding right now, okay? <laughs> Oops. Let's get over here. We gotta make a turn. Oh, you know what? Wait a minute. Did I start the route? Oh, crap. Take a break. Oh, I was supposed to take a break? Mm, whoops. Well, I guess the brakes are bugged. So when you, uh, it'll let you check in the passengers. But after, it, after you check them in, it won't let you proceed. If you just drive, It'll, uh, it'll clear it, but uh, I guess it shows up as a mark against you at the end, because you, you guys will see what happens at the end of the row. So yeah, as you can see guys, very smooth, I'm on the steering wheel, everything's working very smoothly here. The, the wheel comes back, so... Ooh. Let's see, I don't know what the hell... Apparently, this is a... Stop sign of some sort? I have no idea what that means. If somebody's from Europe, let me know. What does that triangle sign with the, uh, the yellow in it? What does that mean? Is that like a yield? Uh, I'm not sure. And what the hell is this? And where am I going? Um... Oh, is this, this is a roundabout? Okay. First roundabout we've seen so far. Okay, interesting. I'm going straight, so don't change on me. Please stay green, thank you. That was awesome. Okay, we gotta make a turn here. And then <laughs> a turn. Yes, and that's our last time. So now it's gonna it's gonna stutter again. So I'm hoping it'll only do this when we first discover a place. Yeah. Wow. Got an achievement already. Sweet. All right. So. Neutral. Stay on park. Let's go. I'll be opening this so we can get our luggage. Thank you all for riding my bus today. I'm sorry if it wasn't the smoothest ride, but as I said, I am new to the area. I am new to Flix Bus, and uh, I hope you will join me on my next route. Thank you so much for driving with me today. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I love it. Yep. Really good. Really good. As I said, guys, you know, I don't know... We're just going to be like 50 hours in, but for my first route, it was a long one. I apologize about that. I thoroughly enjoyed it. So let's, let's end the run. I guess we just log out here.